Hey beautiful people, what's up, what's popping, what's good, what's good? It's Moana, welcome back to my channel. So, as you see today, hmm, this really smells like rosemary. <laughs> okay, now if I complain about pimples on my nose, it's over because of this. But this thing is full of butter and um, oil, literally oils only. Yeah, so I'm showing you how I make I made this. This is my simple hair butter. There's aloe vera, there's shea butter, avocado oil, and lots of oils, including avocado and uh, rosemary because i didn't want my butter to smell like shea butter because shea butter is not that it doesn't give the pleasant smell doesn't give you the vibes of i want to put hair butter in my hair but this scent it is all natural i didn't put any preservative that's why i made a small batch because i know within two weeks this thing will be all done or two to three weeks.
so this is how i use my butter in my spray bottle today there is no aloe vera i'm using uh onion onion oil it's a blend of a mixture of different oils mixed with uh onions it's very good for your hair it makes your hair fully hydrated and moisturized so after spraying i massage it all you see the difference now my hair is falling where it is supposed to fall mm, it feels so nice it's, you know with sheer butter it melts so fast So I put it direct onto my hair. So a little goes along so you don't have to put in too much but even if you put in too much it's not going to make your hair greasy so that's why i had to first put in some water or you can use aloe vera itself or you can use this onion spray so massage it in So the good thing about this butter is you can put it in your hair. It is full natural shea butter and organic oils with a rosemary. I got it from my backyard. I planted it. So with this, it is good also for your skin. For people who are dry skin after showering, when your skin is still damp, you can put it on your skin not in your face face no skin the entire body yes so it's not going to give you rashes it will actually help you with the eczema uh, rash to clear out the the rash you have like heat rust heat rash since it is uh, hot these days so hmm, keep it away from water i feel like I want to put it on my skin but uh, my skin is oily so I can't but I will when I'm going to put on my shoes that's it for today thank you for watching guys thank you thank you yeah god bless you